Hello, do you know why I'm taking this water? It's because water is very vital to your health. The same way, mathematics meal is very vital to your mathematical health. Join me later on mathematics meal. Thank you. Alright, welcome to Mathematics Mail. This is a special program that is designed to help students in the study of mathematics. Today on Mathematics Mail, we shall be looking at breakfast question 17. We have a series of breakfast questions, just short questions that we designed to stimulate you as far as mathematics is concerned. Now remember there is need for you to subscribe to our YouTube channel and also follow us on Facebook. Thank you. Now today we have a question from Theory of Log Reading in our previous question today. And the, this is the question if a square plus b square is equal to 23ab show that log a plus log b will give us two log bracket open a plus b all over five bracket closes. All right, let's look at this problem. This is a problem of a proof to prove that this is this with the available information. Now, since this is from theory of log reading, we are going to apply the knowledge of the laws of log reading in trying to solve this problem. Apart from that, we also bring in the knowledge of algebra in order to solve this particular problem. So let's begin from what we know to the unknown, right? Let's move. We have that a square plus b square is 23ab. And from here, we want to show that this is equal to this, okay? Now, from algebraic expansion, a square plus b square, I can write it as a square, uh, I can write it as a plus b, all square minus 2ab, the whole of this. So a square, a square plus b square is something as a plus b, all square minus 2ab. Yeah, that's correct, because if you expand this, of a plus b, all square. If you expand this, you are going to have a square plus 2ab, plus b square. So if you now subtract minus 2ab from it, you arrive at this. So a plus b all squared is this. So if I now have a plus b all squared minus 2ab, it's going to be a squared plus 2ab plus b squared minus 2ab. And 2ab minus 2ab is 0, so I'm left with a squared plus b squared. So a squared, a plus b all squared minus 2ab is something as this. So this can be written like this. So we have the left hand side of this expression, we can write it like this, and this is equal to 23ab. We have proved that a squared plus b squared is something as a plus b all squared minus 2ab from here. So a squared plus b squared is something as this. And that's why we use this expression to replace it. Okay? We can go further. If I take this here, I'm going to have a plus b all squared equals 23ab plus 2ab. Okay? That will also give us a plus b all squared. This plus this will give us 25 a B. Alright. Now if we take square root on both sides, take square root on both sides. If you take square root on both sides, we're going to have a plus b. That's what we have here. Or square root of 25 a b. 
So square root of this is already this. Then square root of this side. Square root of 25 will give us 5. We are ha left with what? AB under the root sign. Okay? We can move further from here. Let's look at that. So we have this. I can divide both sides by 5. Dividing both sides by 5 will give me a plus b divided by 5 equals square root of a b. Now, we know that square root of a term or a number is that number raised to power half. So, I can still write this as a plus b all upon 5 equals a b all raised to power 1 over 2 because of the square root. Okay, let's take logarithm on both sides. Take log on both sides on both sides if we take log on both sides we are going to have log a plus b divided by 5 plus log a b raised to power half if we apply the law of log rhythm, the third law when the power is on the number, it's something as the coefficient. So I can write the right hand side as 1 over 2 log AB. So I have log A plus B divided by 5. Okay? Now, applying the first law of log reading, you remember that if I have log AB, it's something as say log A plus log B according to the first law of log reading. So with that, I can actually write this to be 1 over 2 into log A plus log B using the first law of log reading. OK, then if I multiply both sides by 2, remember we still have log a plus b divided by 5 here. Yeah. Still have that on the left hand side. Multiplying both sides by 2 will give me 2 log a plus b divided by 5 bracket closes then log a plus log b. Wow. I think we are done. So from here now we can now show that log a plus log b is equal to the that is equal to this is equal to 2 log a plus b divided by 5. Alright. That's all on breakfast question 17. I believe that you enjoy this meal. Remember, a meal a day is necessary to keep you mathematically healthy. Continue to enjoy mathematics meal. Remember, also there is need for you to subscribe to our YouTube channel, like our Facebook page, and also share our videos. Thank you, and God bless you.